So guys, today we're gonna look about Nitro Pack. It is very popular nowadays and a lot of you requested me to make video about this. Some people say it works very fine to improve website speed and some people say it is a scam. So let's find out how useful it is, how you can implement Nitro Pack on your website. Is it a scam or not? If it is not a scam, then how much it can improve your website speed? Just a disclaimer, I used Nitro Pack like two years before, so I do not remember anything about it. So it's gonna be like almost first time impression for me about Nitro Pack and how much it can improve your website speed. You can see this is a Nitro Pack homepage. You can have fast website too. They show very promising scores. Homepage like 96%, feature pay 98%, 99%. They're very good rating on Trustpilot, looks like. And it is available for WordPress, WooCommerce, OpenCart, Magento and custom websites. Looks super fine. And if we go here on pricing, we can see. So you have four plans available, free, business growth and scale. We are going to go only free plan. You do not need to add your credit card or pay anything to test your website. It is ideal for testing low traffic websites. You can have up to 5,000 monthly page views and one GB per month CD and bandwidth. And you can add only one website. So we're going to cover this one. So I'm going to click on get started and let's see how Nitro Pack will optimize my website. I'm going to create an account for me. So I fill the form with all the details and you can see here it is zero dollars. And in the end, check the captcha and then agree to terms and condition and click on almost there. Now they're asking you to verify some information. Click on place order. Okay, check out successful. We didn't pay anything and we successfully created a Nitro Pack account. I'm gonna go to dashboard. Okay, welcome to Nitro Pack. Let us walk you through dashboard. It will take less than one minute. Next, 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 next. Skip. You can see by default my website URL is added. I give this information while creating Nitro Pack account. And this is a dashboard. Looks very simple. Cache it zero. Optimize pages zero. Looks like there's nothing here because I haven't connected my website with Nitro Pack yet. And let's see how we can connect our website. On the top, you have all the options which you will need to optimize your website or to make your website faster. So click on connect your website. So they have API details and we're going to need to use this site ID and secret to connect our website. And then we need to download a connector. So let's download a connector. I'm sure it's going to give some plugin for different kind of uh, platforms. Yes, here we go. So we have official Nitro Pack for WordPress. If you want to use for WooCommerce, we can use this one. But because I'm testing only WordPress website, which is not having WooCommerce, so I'm going to test the Nitro Pack for WordPress. I'm going to download it, then get the plugin. Here's the plugin. I'm going to download the plugin in my downloads folder. Now we're going to install the plugin which Nitro Pack gave us. So I'm going to hold on plugins and then click on add new. And then upload plugin. Browse. And I'm going to select the Nitro Pack plugin. We just downloaded it from downloads folder. Open. Then click on install now. Then click on activate plugin. Looks pretty easy, but the main thing will be how much it will improve the website speed. Because if it doesn't improve our website speed, all this effort is going to be waste. And we are going to see that thing also that a lot of people said it is a scam. So we're going to see if it is a scam or not. If they're giving you a basic plan with $0 per month, it doesn't look like very bad to me. And a lot of you will have less than 5,000 views per month. So it can be a good thing for all of you who have less than 5,000 views per month. Plugin is activated and we're going to settings just by clicking here. Okay, let's get started. Connect to Nitro Pack. Connect to Nitro Pack. Because I'm already logged in in this browser in Nitro Pack account. So when I clicked here, they directly connected me. Otherwise, you had an option to connect manually by entering details. I'm sure that if you use that option, you're going to need to enter site ID and site secret. It's good we are connected directly. Before I move forward, I would like to show you how much my website is going right now on Google PageSpeed scores. So let's see. I already performed a test. So this is my website. You can see it's scoring 66. FCP is super bad. Speed index, time to interactive is very bad. Total blocking time is not so bad. And everything looks like very bad. And we have a lot of issues in Google Pay Speed Score. This is for mobile devices. I'm sure for desktop, it will be better. So let's check on desktop. Okay, it is scoring 89. Not very bad. It is a nice score. We have some issues with speed index. So we downloaded Nitro Pack. I'm going to go back to my website dashboard. Okay, so now processing two pages in the background. I think with time, they're going to process the other pages on my website also. I'm very excited to see the results that how it's going to be and how much my website score will improve. And then there's some details about your plan, how much CDN you consumed and how much page views served by Nitro Pack. And let's see what else they have. Optimization mode, standard, medium, strong, ludicrous, manual. Wow, ludicrous looks like super amazing. And then we are setting cache warm up, safe mode, HTML compression. HTML compression by default enabled. And there's cache warm up. Let's label cache warm up. Enabling cache warm will use 14 page optimization. Would you like to continue? Yes. 
and then you have purge affected cache when contains update to publish wow looks very simple in contrast to other plugins we are using this looks a very simple setup but we're going to see that how much effect it going to bring to a website it looks simple but is it good or not in compared to other plugin like lightspeed cache wp fast cache or in case if you use cloud based server plus object cache pro how much this plugin going to be standing against all those other optimization plugins and optimization services this will going to be interesting thing to see then you have help here okay some faqs diagnostic okay if you want to debug nitro pack you can do that from here we're going to go back to dashboard here okay we have 10 page optimized if you're going to go back to this dashboard here let's go back here dashboard and let's see if it's showing the same thing yes it's showing the same thing we have 10 page optimized cache size 2.19 mb and last page never an active feature you can see image lazy loading is active critical css is active html and css minification are active combined css is active iframe lazy loading delay resources lazy load hidden images image optimization cache warm up css and js compression global cdn looks like super amazing they have all the features already activated and these are really nice feature in normally in other plugins you need to do a lot of setup to use these features okay everything looks nice what else is here there's some optimization here okay all the pages which are optimized are added here and then we have settings the same setting we saw in wordpress dashboard like this one to change the optimization modes and then we have some general settings improve server response time why it is not enabled i would like to enable it ah looks like it it is enabled safe mode is not enabled speed insider we don't want to give any details about the website included uris extend urls cache ajax urls why not let's use this one okay they are asking some urls we want to leave it we going to see like how simply it going to optimize the website and there lot of other settings also but i don't understand here we enabled everything so why they are showing disabled here because you see the lot of feature you can see their active features but in this page the lot of features are not enabled okay we going to see after how much effect it going to bring to website by using the default settings then if cache warm up it is already enabled if you want you can use this play button and warm up the cache then we have service usage log it will log all the services maybe the page visits and the cdn you used and everything what nitro pack did on your website going to be here then you have billing account and help center so now this is the moment of truth this was the easiest implementation of any optimization plugin i ever used we going to refresh this course it was 66 and 89 so let's see how much it becomes now i'm going to click on analyze and one more thing so i open a website on proud browsing looks like everything is working fine website did not broke and let's go and check some hosting deals yeah guys if you want to get some nice amazing hosting deals you can check my website page here yeah everything looks nice so let's check back what are the scores now okay the tests were performed okay our website is scoring 91 for mobile devices and for desktop score 19 and wow super amazing super amazing transformation i love that and it's free only the thing is that it is limited up to 5000 views and sometimes you need to retest your website multiple time to see the real scores so let's do one thing generalize the website and let's check back the scores again okay test is perform 91 99 looks like their old scores because since now google page speed changed their interface and now you cannot you cannot perform the test so fast you need to wait for some time okay so it was ludicrous mode wow for ludicrous mode it is not a big optimization honestly because this course 91 19 we can get by lightspeed cache also if you want to check my video on lightspeed cache check out the link in the description that how i optimize website 100 out of 100 using lightspeed cache and everything was free you do not need to pay anything for me honestly after activating all these features i'm getting only 91 out of 100 for google page speed and that is a really good score you should not worry about like why this 91 why it is not 100 if you're getting anything about 85 90 that's a really good scores focus on website content do not be obsessed about website speed scores on google page speed so guys my final thought after this is the implementation of nitro on website it looks legit it is not doing anything magical it is doing the all the things which other plugins do but it takes the least time and it is free so why not if you have less than 5000 views on your website and you are happy with 1 gb of cdn limit you can use this free version absolutely would i recommend to use the paid plans i don't know yet i'm going to make advanced video about nitro pack and if we can get more scores with nitro pack or not
Guys, if you're new here, don't forget to subscribe to my channel and smash the like button if you want to know how to improve your website speed significantly and to learn amazing tips and tricks. And if you haven't checked how I got 100 out of 100 using Lightspeed Cache plugin free of cost, check out this video on screen. Thank you so much. See you in another video.